Okay. Good morning, everyone. Well, um, at least it's uh, morning in my uh, current time. I am Gabriel Garperio, and I welcome you all to A Day in the Life. Now, the Lord's Loop approached me to do this, and uh, I happily agreed. Uh, it's because I want to use this video as a means to help you, my fellow Lurditions, even through small ways. Na, through this video, through peering into my life through a day in my life, you'll be able to learn something new, uh, learn something beneficial that you could hopefully incorporate into your daily life. So, with that intro out of the way, let's begin. First things first, I wake up. On this day, uh, 8 a.m. is the time I woke up. So I get up, uh, fix my bed, and move on. Then I go to the bathroom, do my business, wash my face, brush my teeth, and I eventually get to sitting down. So yeah, that's how I got to sitting here. So, with my parents both gone at the moment uh, in the morning because my father is off biking, uh, he likes to exercise, and my mother at work currently, uh, at this point in time, I will most probably be... Oh, my alarm! Sorry, I forgot to mention, it's that time of day. <sighs> okay, so yeah, I forgot to explain. So during the SEM break, I've been doing this thing where uh, every single hour, I'll be doing an exercise at by the time the alarm goes off. So until 6 p.m., because that's my cho chosen cut-off time, I'll be doing push-ups, well, a variety of push-ups, crunches and squats so let's say 8 a.m. I do push-ups 30 push-ups is my requirement then then the next hour 30 push-ups again next hour 30 push-ups again next hour 30 push-ups again then I'll get tired of the push-ups and then next hour will be 30 crunches so on then 30 squats then 6 p.m. cut off time I'll be I won't be working out so you could be wondering why why don't I just do uh, push-ups today until 6 p.m. Squats tomorrow. Crunches the next day. It's because my muscles will get tired. My muscles will die. I'll die. I mean, I'll probably be able to do like 30 crunches from the start to finish until 6 p.m. Maybe even squats as well. But not push-ups. I'll die. So with that out of the way, Again, at this point in time, I will most probably be... Yeah, I'll, I'll most probably be gaming, uh, playing, playing games. So today, I'll be playing uh, Uncharted 4. And uh, Uncharted is a uh, video game series uh, created by... Uh, Amy Hennig, uh, video game director, and it was developed by Naughty Dog. Uh, so, Uncharted is an action adventure video game series. So that means parkour, fighting, shooting, climbing, swinging, and many more. It's like starring in your own action movie. I believe I've heard someone call it before. So. To give a little taste of what Uncharted is like, this goes to this. And this goes to this. And eventually, that goes to this. Whoa! 
so yeah, it's it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Okay, so it's now uh, 10 a.m. or roughly around that time, and look who just got back from his bike ride. Hey, hi, Dad. Yeah. All right. So um, usually when my dad gets back, uh, he'll be ano, going to the karinderia naren to buy our food. So uh, ano nga polit yung ulam ko, Dad? Pritong uh, bangus at ilagang baka. Pritong bangus, ilagang baka. Sounds pretty good, so I'll start eating na. E yeah, no, I'm kidding. I don't drink. <laughs> Tubig lang malakas! Grabe, <laughs> dramatic yung mga sit kakain na naman. Okay, so I will see you guys in a few minutes. That didn't take too long, now did it? Okay, so 1 p.m. And since I've, I feel like I've been able to digest my food, uh, well, you know what that means? It's time! Okay, so with the push-ups out of the way, let's now move on to the uh, main activity that I do uh, usually uh, when the clocks uh, the clock hits 1 p.m. and that is ah <laughs> okay I'm gonna cut that out CSGO is a multiplayer first-person shooter that both my friend and I enjoy playing, well, a lot. The reason why I like playing CSGO is because, well, it's, well, it's a game that serves as a platform for both my friend and I to engage in friendly competition because we're both competitive by nature. Yeah, in this way, we'll be able to engage in that uh, friendly competition without throwing hands. Minecraft is a sandbox video game that is very, very well known. The goal of Minecraft is, well, it doesn't really have one per se. Because even when you beat the game, which is through beating the Ender Dragon, the game's final boss, the game does not end there. The player can actually set their own goals as they continue playing. They can play to create, play to destroy, what the game allows is, well, a lot of things. Players are limited only by their imagination. And, of course, by what the game allows. But even then, there are still a lot of things that players can do regardless of the game's mechanics. One of those things are Minecraft adventure maps. Maps that are, well, player-made, uh, that are for the purpose of being played by others. So in this one, we're playing a map called Diversity 2. My friend and I played the first one beforehand, and we wanted to see how this sequel fared in comparison with the first. So since it is more on... Uh, the focus of the map is more on puzzles, my friend and I had to cooperate a lot more for this one. But the main emphasis is that uh, this game is very important to my friend and I because it's very nostalgic, especially since it has been a part, it has been a part of our childhood, 
uh, for the longest time, and somehow, even until now, it's still something that we continue to play together. Okay, so uh, this upcoming one is a bit of a, it's a different one, different from the usual thing I do. Pero I reserved it for today, uh, the filming process. It, I reserved it for the filming process because parang maging mas malaman yung day ko ngayon. So I'll be doing the home-based workout, the bonus points uh, for my PE class. So, uh, of course, I won't show you the entire video, maski time lapse, but here is a short snippet of me working out fully. Okay, so I did not have time to do a cool, a cool transition anymore because I was too tired. But uh, to lighten the mood, Mom is back. Say hi, Mom. Yeah. So uh, you know, with uh, the day uh, coming to a close, I believe it is now time to uh, eat dinner, and the dinner will be Papa. Yes. Not a sponsorship. So, uh, I will see you guys in a few. And then we'll move on to the next festivities or the remaining festivities of, of the day. So, uh, it's uh, coming towards a uh, an end na, no. So the time is currently uh, 9 p.m. and uh, it's uh, cut off time. So. Uh, I guess it's time to give the outro. So first and foremost, I had a lot of fun doing this activity. Maski of course, dagdag trabaho and dapat nagpapahinga. Pero regardless, I took on the challenge kasi like I said sa simula, I wanted to, to do this because um, uh, I know na somehow, in some way, it will be able to help uh, you guys. So. Uh, before uh, I end uh, the, this day in my life, I want to say lang, uh, the lesson I want to leave is that you do, you pursue what you want to pursue. Tayo nga, my life is is not something to write home about. It's very mundane Go if, if it's compared to other people, but I'm very satisfied with it. So just as long as you do what you believe is best for you, you do what you enjoy then then that's all that really matters in the end so with that i would like to say thank you for watching i am Briel carperio and uh, this was a day in the life